That is number six. I've declared war on them. I'll be packing his ass off to relocate him. Thought you'd like to see him. Bye. y'all I want to show you these two little rifles here these are 22's uh, when I was a kid they used to be uh, carnivals would come to town and they'd set up in a shopping center across the highway from where I lived and one of the games that they would bring with them was a, a little van that had a uh, gallery a little shooting gallery set up in the end of it and the prizes were these huge gold ornate clocks and these real pretty palomino stallions all in solid would look like solid gold with a clock embedded in it and they would have three or four of these up above the gallery and then they had these normally two of these uh, type weapons laying there and you shot at a little target with a little red dot a little round circle in it. If you shot the circle out, uh, you'd theoretically win one of these huge clocks. And it cost a dollar to shoot one. Well, I, I never had a dollar, but uh, I enjoyed standing there on a Friday evening and watching these local yokels uh, tanked up on beer come in there and they would lose their entire paycheck trying to shoot that little red dot out and the following year when the uh, carnival would come back they'd have the same prizes up there. I never saw anybody win anything uh, along with the uh, bowling ball on a chain standing by the bowling pin those type of uh, games you weren't meant to win but they would sit there and the guy would try to walk off and they'd hold him by the shirt. Wait a minute, now you almost got it. In, and they would sit there and take their whole damn paycheck. And, and I would just marvel at the stupidity of having to go home and no food, no rent money, no electric money, nothing. But uh, these are the types that they used um, similar to this. I never looked at the make or the model. They probably had uh, Winchester 62's. These two happen to be Winchester, uh, uh, correction, I'm sorry, Rossi's. Uh, this is the model 62 uh, SA. This is the model 62 SAC. Now that uh, SA stands for slide action and the SAC is slide action Model C. Yeah, the C doesn't denote any word. But um, I call all these because of the the type slide that it has on there with these ridges cut in. I call them all gallery 22s. Uh, actually, uh, this shorter one with the uh, 16 and a half inch barrel is the gallery model. Uh, this one's longer with a 20, I think it's 23 inch. Um, these will fire long rifle, longs, and shorts. And I picked these up someplace about, I don't know, 20 years ago or somewhere in, in that area. And I think I got them both for 300 bucks. Um, some good old boy was selling them. But I uh, thought you might like to have a look at them. And now I gave this one to my daughter. It's no longer mine. Um, this is not a nickel plate. It, it's, it looks like a nickel plate, but it is. And it's a brushed stainless, or appears to be brushed stainless. And um, just a cute little gun. Little gallery 22s. They're accurate. Um, they're well-made guns. 
you can see the Rossi emblem that wrong side Rossi emblem right there both of them take down by removing this knurled screw right here it'll break down into two pieces if you notice these are the locking lugs once you work the action okay both these guns have been pre-checked they're not loaded but the log the lugs pop down in there it does not have any safety other than a half cock just cute little guns and they always remind me of those carnivals that would come through periodically um, this one here weighs in at uh, I think it, a little over four and a half pounds nice little plinking gun I use them for uh, rat shot for snakes the poisonous snakes that happen to wander up in the yard this one here has a 23 inch barrel on it it's blued it'll hold uh, 12 rounds now I didn't check to see how many shorts and all that type of thing they're well made guns they're made in Brazil imported I think by inner arms um, I called the factory this morning uh, they gave me another number because uh, Rossi Amadeo Rossi has been bought out by uh, Taurus and they weren't familiar with what that C stood for they gave me another phone number to call and they told me it didn't stand for anything except the model nice looking little stock but uh... fun gun to plank with thought you might enjoy seeing them uh, it, it, they, they just whole special memory sitting there watching these guys lose their paychecks it, it was something never saw anybody win a damn thing but um, this is the Rossi model 62 SA and Rossi model 62 SAC uh, both copies of the old uh, Winchester model 62 uh, these both of these are made in Brazil by the way but I thought you might like to look at them. Appreciate you watching. Bye.